Guys, delicious golf oysters, and if you love a good oyster, the golf oyster has to be high on your list. I've got Roz here with me. He is the VP down here at Prestige. How many how many years now have you guys been doing this? Uh, well over 30 years now. My, my father's been in the business. Family-owned business. We took a walk through the office a little while. You're related to everybody up there. Absolutely, yeah. All, a big, big family-run business. I love it. All right, let's talk about the product here because uh, this is just a sample of what you guys produce here, and you're one of the largest producers in the country. That's right. Talk about that. Yeah, so we're one of the largest producers here in the Gulf Coast. We have we provide a market for over 150 boats in peak season with three processing plants. And we ship oysters all across the country, uh, from food service, national chain, chain accounts, to your local retail stores. All right, and most of the boats are out right now because uh, you said some will be coming back around 11, some will be coming back around 3 o'clock. And let's talk about this little guy over here because there's different boats for different areas where you guys are harvesting, right? What about this little boat? What does that do? Yeah, so that's a sh shallow draft boat. So similar areas where it's really shallow, where oysters grow, we don't want to definitely drag a lugger through there. That's going to you know, tear up the bottom. So we use a small guy like that, and uh, they'll go out there and harvest some sacks. And this other guy right here next to us, that's for deeper water? Uh, Texas water is your traditional oyster lugger, slow moving, uh, but that's what you would see normally out in traditional waters, harvesting oysters. And how many boats are out right now? Uh, right now we have a handful of boats, seven to eight vessels harvesting oysters today. So let's talk about, like, volume. How much, I mean, how many oysters come through here in a day, or do you guys measure it by the month, by the year? How does that work? Yeah, uh, it all depends on the season, but uh, right now, for example, we'll probably be processing a couple hundred thousand oysters between today and tomorrow. And what is the demand like right now? Uh, the demand is through the roof, you know, post-pandemic, everyone's trying to get product in, uh, the country's opening up, so we're trying to meet that demand, and everyone's working really hard to do so. So if somebody wants to go to the grocery store right now and get, like, this little guy, where do they find your product? Uh, you can find a product across a number of stores, your local central market, Whole Foods, Walmart, uh, some of the, all these markets carry these two products. Question, are you hiring? Are you looking for some folks or are you at capacity? You know, we're always looking for good people to hire on Team Prestige. Because, you know, people are always looking yeah. uh, for a little guy, for a little gig. So, guys, I got to tell you, I've never been down here to San Leon and uh, I, I thought I was driving to the end of the world and finally I found Prestige down here and who would have thought that right, you know, basically in our backyard, these guys are producing all of these amazing uh, oysters. And how many people do you have indoors shucking at one time? Uh, at this facility right now, we have about 25 shuckers. So what I'm going to do for you guys is I'm going to go back in it a little bit here, post some video on our Facebook page. We could not get a live television signal out of the facility when we were inside the processing plant, so that's why we're standing out here uh, by the uh, by the end by the uh, by the docks. So if you guys, uh, if folks, how many restaurants are you working with right now? Would you say in the area? Uh, in the area, I mean. Well, across the country, it's thousands of restaurants that we service. You can get a prestige oyster there. Right, you've, right, you've, been, you've been in the business for a long time. Last question, because, you know, the East Coast loves their oysters. I know being in the business, you've tried oysters from everywhere. Gulf oyster number one? For me, it's always the oyster you grew up eating. Uh, so for me, Gulf Coast uh, wins every day. There you go. All right, guys. Prestige Oysters, Inc., a, a very successful family business down here in San Leon. Coming up, we're going over to a local restaurant that is taking these oysters and turning them into a delicious dish. We'll see you then. Right now, we're live in San Leon. Ruben Dominguez, Fox 26 News.